<laughs> oh, Slick McGrick. <laughs> it's been a rough 30 days for you, my friend. <laughs> you were the 2023 Old Home Week Cup winner. But it doesn't matter. Because I came in and took it from you. <laughs> Henderson Kite has taken the Old Home Cup. Slick McGrick having words with the referee, looking visibly frustrated. And can you blame him? It, he's just lost both his title shot and his trophy. And then in October, oh, Frank, you couldn't win the Rumble. No title shot for Slick. You were one of the favorites. But you know what? It doesn't matter. You blew it. <laughs> but I'm a fair man. I'm a just man. And for that very reason, you're going to have another opportunity to get this cup back. The only problem is, <laughs> you're going to have to take it back from him. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, an absolutely unsettling promo from the office, presumably, of Henderson Kite. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Henderson Kite Hailing has... from the deepest, darkest truths of your mind. Weighing in at 235 pounds. Henderson Kite presents... Ha! Henderson Kite in full possession of the Old Home Week Cup. And we know that that cup was actually won by Slick McGrick, who has been on, a, on the warpath trying to get it back. Will tonight be the night? And what is Henderson Kite and Havoc's obsession with the Old Home Week Cup? And the fans really letting him have it here. He has taken that, it does not belong to him. Havoc has some obsession with it. Henderson Kite, just the master manipulator, just seems as though he wants to, he wants to just manipulate and he wants to enrage Slick McGreg. He just saw someone having some success, maybe success that he wasn't having, even though he's managed several multiple time tag team champions and he has the monster Havoc seemingly under his thumb. He just could not leave it alone. Slick McGrick, you know that he's going to have some kind of innovative offense when he comes out here tonight looking to get that cup back. We saw him during the Rumble last month come out in a camouflage suit. We had no idea who it was. Slick McGrick getting paid by the hour, I guess, waiting for the music to peak before he uh, peeks through the curtain. There is the man himself. Slick McGrick high five coming in here. It's absolutely deafening and thunderous. And there may be a bit of a Christmas theme to his gear. I'm not uh, entirely certain uh, what I'm looking at right there, but well, more on that situation as it develops. Slick McGrick, a man who holds not one, but two engineering degrees from the University of New Brunswick and trained at the Lance Storm Academy out in Calgary, the renowned Storm Wrestling Academy. So definitely check that out. I think that's a name that we're going to be hearing a lot tonight as we have several, several wrestlers who have trained at that prestigious academy coming in and lighting up the ring with their technical skills. So I know that we're going to see something out of Slick. A little trouble crossing underneath that, uh, that rope there. But you can see, <laughs> amazing. I've never seen a beard decorated exactly like that. But you can see he's got it adorned with Christmas balls. Even though kind of an oh, LC. Oh, Piers, we have some words from Henderson Kite. Slick McGrick, shut up! Just another, another ring personality who cannot stand the CCW I can audience. All night.
Slick, I think you, I think you're gonna want to hear this. I want to apologize. This is a surprising turn of events. I'm a, no, I'm serious. This is an apology, folks. Listen, shut up for a second. I think they, if he wants a chance to apologize, they should let him do it. I know I've done some rotten things in the past, but it is the holiday season. Rotten things in the, the past. I'd say. I want to offer up an apology. I am not the 2023 Old Home Week Cup winner. I'm well, not. An unusual I'm dose not. of reality from Henderson Kite. That's right. I agree with you. I believe he has termites in his soul. The real 2023 Old Home Week Cup winner is in this very ring. So, let Can me he, just give it to Is this the actually happening right, right now? Havoc! <laughs> okay, yeah, Havoc is not absolutely not the actual winner of the old Home Week Cup. It was like, it looked for a moment like he was going to return it. A promise is a promise. I did say that you would have another opportunity to get it back. And that is what we are going to do. Shut up! Crowd just absolutely having none of it right now. So right now, referee, this is on the line. He's got another opportunity. I'll get it for you. All right, so it looks like the home, old home week shot. cup Slick. will be available for Slick to win back. We have referee Alex holding it um, aloft as though it was a title belt. Looks like it's going to be defended Go in this on. match. Somewhat dubious that Henderson Kite is going to be hanging on to the cup uh, while its fate is being determined, but it is his to give away, I suppose, possession being nine tenths of the law. Referee giving Havoc a quick check there. You never know what's quite in that jumpsuit, and I think we've seen Henderson Kite's cane get involved a few too many times during these matches as well. Right there, yep, checking the abs. Slick McGrick, looking like he's been hitting the gym, coming in at six foot 225, the master of the grease trap and the top rope elbow. And we are off right now. Will Havoc be as distracted by the beard Christmas decorates? Henderson Kite already up on the apron. What is going on right now? Slick McGrick doing, it looks like he's got a candy cane crowbar. Cheese and rice. Holy cheese biscuits. And he's giving it, it's a present for Havoc. Maybe he's trying to, he's trying to foster a positive attitude in Havoc. Who seems as though he wants to, did he slip? What in the world is happening right now? Ring the bell. Ring the bell. <laughs> I, I cannot believe what is happening right there. It looks like Havoc was disqualified because he was the one holding the candy cane crowbar. And it appears Slick McGrick. There's the innovative offense of Slick McGrick coming to play right there. It looks like he's outsmarted Henderson Kite. He's got to be absolutely furious. And I'm sure the crowd is eating it up right now. What is Henderson Kite going to do about this Slick? Uh, I can't get a good uh, eyes on him. It appears he, yeah, he's in possession of the old home week cup. The referee managed to get it and give it back. Henderson throwing his coat in a fit of rage right now. He can absolutely not handle it right now. Slick McGrick just celebrating with the CCW audience who's happy to see justice served. So I guess hand it off to uh, referee Alex. And <laughs> Henderson Kite absolutely foaming at the mouth. Goodness prevails on Christmas right now, where Slick is able to get his his cup back. You know, just in time to fill it with I don't know peppermint or frankincense or myrrh or whatever he you know chooses to celebrate his holidays with. Henderson quite needing a microphone right now is Henderson Kite. Can you run that up to Henderson Kite? <laughs> Looks like he has something else that he wants to say, so I'm really curious how the CCW audience is going to respond to this after he mis basically mistreated this. Is a Not impressed with the result. Stole Havoc's cup. I think he's got it mixed up. 
He is backwards. I don't want that! That's it! Swing the brick! That's the last straw! Next month, I'm gonna kill you! Shots fired right now, Henderson Kite. In fact, <laughs> next month, it's gonna be a Viking funeral! Curious words from Henderson Kite. We know that he has associated himself in the past with a gentleman by the name of Oni Bjornsson, which if you've been following independent wrestling here in New Brunswick, might be familiar with some of his work. Could Viking Funeral be alluding to Oni's return? And will he be joining, joining with Havoc and Henderson, or will it be a swap out as Havoc not having the showing of his lifetime right now during this uh, during this series of events right now. His obsession with now both the old home week cup as well as the candy cane crowbar is what it looks like. Definitely not serving the interests of Henderson Kite who certainly was an only child.